Trump admits Melania hates him mocking transgender weightlifters Former President Donald Trump said Sunday that his wife Melania hates it when he makes fun of transgender weightlifters and when he dances on stage at the end of his rallies, calling it, not presidential. Time equals, 400 Ms. Greater than the ex-president and 2024 GOP hopeful shared the former first lady's take during a rally Sunday in Sioux City, Iowa. A state Trump is dominating in the polls. Melania has stayed off the campaign trail since Trump announced in mid-November his intentions to retake the White House. Time equals, 400 Ms. Greater than, our first lady hates it when I do. She hates, she says, darling, I love you so much but this is not presidential. When you do the weightlifting, this is not presidential, or when you do the swimming thing, it's not, you know and I understand, Trump said. He bounced both arms in the air as he spoke, holding up imaginary barbells and made a funny voice. Former President Donald Trump said Sunday that his wife Melania hates it when he makes fun of transgender weightlifters and when he dances on stage at the end of his rallies, calling it, not presidential, or when you dance off the stage, he continued, quoting Melania, at the end of every rally, Trump does an awkward robot dance as he shimmies off stage. Currently he does the dance to Hold On, I'm Coming, by Sam and Dave, but he often danced to the Village People's YMCA during the 2020 race. Time equals, 400 Ms. greater than, she said, darling I love you, I love you, but this is not presidential, you don't dance off the stage, the ex-president said. I said, look, look, we've got a year to go. Everybody loves us, I love everybody, the country's going to hell in a handbasket. Let's do a little dancing, he said. Trump said Melania's technically right, but what the hell, he added. Former First Lady Melania Trump has stayed off the campaign trail since Trump announced his intentions in mid-November to retake the White House in 2024 while Trump initially tried courting the LGBTQ community during his 2016 run. He pushed a number of anti-trans policies during his four years in office including announcing the banishment of openly trans service members from the armed forces via tweet and rolling back Obama-era health protections. Time equals, 400 Ms. greater than Trump and other Republican hopefuls have spoken out against the participation of trans women in women's sports. It's very demeaning to women, Trump said at Sunday's rally after impersonating transgender swimmers and weightlifters. At the same event, Trump, 77, flubbed. The name of the locale, calling it, Sioux Falls. After his gaffe, a man came on stage and whispered in his ear, telling Trump he was in Sioux City.